So in this video I'm going to give you a demo of Copilot Live 8 for the iPhone. I haven't done this previously, I've given you a rundown of the features, but I haven't actually given you a demo of how it works on route. Now no, I haven't got anything connected to this, it's simply me with the iPhone and on the road pretty much. So it's not got any sort of car kit, it's on its own. And I would say it's pretty accurate if you can see it's, it's not lagging at all, unlike the TomTom, -tom, it's pretty smooth. and. Hopefully this, you know, this video will give you an indication of how this works, how well this works. So here we are coming up to a roundabout. I have the sound on; it might help. Just ahead, take second exit at roundabout. Here we are, the roundabout. Getting off at this roundabout. This is our exit, and. I'm going to show you a good feature which you don't have in the TomTom, -tom, which is you can listen to your iPod tunes. So you pretty much go into the settings, go into iPod, and it, what it does is it syncs from your iPod library on your iPhone. So you've got all these songs, I've got plenty of songs, but I've, I'll just play this song that I've got. So you've got music in the background, and you've also got your TomTom -tom running, or your co pilot running at the same time. And again, there's no lagging, even with the iPod there. And again, you can change the song or whatever you want. But again, you don't get this option in the TomTom, -tom, which is pretty neat. Some of the other options on this are driving views. Again, you've got that in the TomTom. -tom. Let's go into settings. Map display, sound, GPS. If you click here, you can have you can see my video that I've done on this feature specifically. But really, in this video, what I want to do is give you or show you what the what it's, what it's like on road. So here we are. Currently, no lags whatsoever. And let me take, show you some of the options uh, in these live services options. Fuel prices feature of Copilot 8 is the fact that you can check for live fuel prices. And I'm at Morrison's at the moment and they've got their own petrol pump. And the nearest fuel prices for Morrison's it's saying £1.06 for unleaded. And let's see whether that is the case or not. Petrol pump should be around the corner here somewhere. There it is. Have to go all the way around to determine whether the prices on this live fuel check. Are correct or not but there it is there anyway where's the board the board is that over there so I can't see it from this angle so here's the Morrison's pump and can we see is it saying one pound and six for unleaded the next one is roadside assistance where you can pretty much give, give um, any sort of breakdown recovery a call if you're breaking down. Use local search or live local search. You can search for hospitals, doctors and so on. So again, you've got these features in the TomTom -tom as well. Now, these options, the premium service or these services have been in the co-pilot since day one. It was included in the original application. Tom Tom got it later on once they found out how good it was in the co-pilot I suppose but that's it for this demo pretty much um, I think I've covered all aspects of, uh, of, the, of the demo if I haven't feel free to leave a comment and let me know what kind of application you prefer Na the only one I haven't tried is Navigo uh, and I'd like to try that out because a lot of you have said it's pretty good but my favourite application or my favourite sat nav application has to be co-pilot this one here Simply because it runs so well, it's got more features over the TomTom, -tom. you can listen to your iPod, you've got the live fuel prices, you might have the live fuel prices in TomTom -tom now, but this has had it from day one, so this is ahead of the game, this application in my opinion. So yeah, that's it for this video, thanks for watching, you can join me on twitter.com slash i6 last region, and thanks.